Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a Magic Book Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at Preserving Mystery from Jamie Ian Swiss. All right, so why are we spending the time to review magic books. Well, because a lot of people ask for it. You know, every time I bust out uh, a new book review, people always say, please more books, because I think more and more people are realizing that a lot of the magical secrets and a lot of the answers that you need are going to be found in books. Most of the time when you buy a DVD, all they're going to do is tell you how to do the trick. Sometimes they won't even tell you how to get into the trick or get out of the trick or how to store it or how to carry it with you. Sometimes they won't even go into the process about how they came up with the trick or who inspired it or who has done this trick before. If you want that kind of information, you're going to want to get into books because books are a wealth. They're a treasure trove of all the things that you're missing out, especially theory. Magic theory is very important because it's the who, the what, the where, the when, the why. It's all those questions that you ask magic performers when you see them live or when when you get into like Q and A's on Instagram or on YouTube, it's the behind the scenes. It's all those answers that you're dying to ask. And books are great because you don't need to fast forward them or rewind them or, you know, need electricity to plug them in. That you're, They're never going to die on you. You can take this on a plane. You can read quietly at a violin recital. Uh, you can take it camping, take it to your brother's baseball game. Uh, magic books are a great way to continue to learn the art that you love. All right, so who is Mr. Swiss? Uh, Mr. Swiss has been a magazine writer. Uh, he's written for Genie, actually, a very popular Genie writer. Uh, worked there for the last 18 years. Now, he's a blogger over at the Lion's Den. That's at magicana.com. He is a great writer. Uh, a lot of people think he's very opinionated, which is fine, uh, as long as you, you know, back up what you say, and he does. He backs it up with facts and reason. He's a very acclaimed performer as well, esteemed lecturer, and a very outspoken critic. All right, so Preserving Mystery, what's it about? What is this book about? Well, it's about theory, and it's a commentary on the world of magic, obviously, and the focus is on the performance of magic and how to improve your art, how to elevate your art, uh, and it's done through 18 different thought-provoking essays. All these essays are about the art, craft, and history of magic, and they're supposed to stimulate you, inform you, excite you, and of course, entertain you. And there's even a trailer for this. You want to see the trailer? This is it. My new book is Preserving Mystery, more than 200 pages, 18 essays about the art, craft, and history of magic, with an introduction by New Yorker writer Adam Gopnik. About the craft, lengthy instruction, and the French drop, how to really learn it literally from the feet up, and when to use gaffes, when to use skill, and Slight Study System, a guide through the literature how to study the sleight of hand magic with cards and coins. Historical pieces including Unpublished Magic by Earl Presto Johnson and Michael Skinner. And pieces, thoughtful pieces and provocative pieces about art and the nature of art and magic, including the difference between mentalism and mental magic and the depiction of magic in film and fiction. All of that and more in Preserving Mystery, which is actually part of a trilogy, including reprints of my first two books, Shattering Illusions and Devious Standards, or as I like to call it, the works. And when you buy the complete set of three books, the signed and numbered slipcase set of the works, you also receive a free copy of Light and Heat, a limited edition hardcover collection of 18 select book reviews for my 18 years of reviewing books for Genie Magazine. This book is not available for sale, but you get it for free with a complete trilogy of Shattering Illusions, Devious Standards, and Preserving Mystery. Tell them you want the works and get Light and Heat for free. All right, so what's inside? What's inside the table of contents? Well, like I said, it's 18 essays. And you gotta think of these as more of essays and not as, uh, you know, learning magic tricks. There's not, I'm not really gonna say that you're gonna learn 
magic effects. He does touch on effects that you probably know, classics of magic, but I don't know that you're gonna learn anything new inside this, especially if you're already a seasoned performer. Uh, to, to look through some of the essays here, uh, he has three different sections, Cannon Fodder, Yesterdays, and A Magician Prepares. In Cannon Fodder, you're gonna see Hack to Death, What Works, How Do I Insult Thee, Let Me Count the Ways, Critical Thinking, Email from a Friend, and Dichotomies, Mentalism versus Mental Magic. He has an essay called The Skinner Touch, A Giant Among Us, and Presto, A Grandmaster. Then in the last section, A Magician Prepares, you're gonna find Making Introductions, Suiting Repertoire, On the French Drop, Gaffes versus Skill, which is probably my very favorite essay in this whole book. This essay was worth the read, worth the entire book alone, just for this one essay. Uh, there's the Swiss Light Study System, and he closes with Preserving Mystery. All right, so what's it cost? Uh, this book is $35. This book alone is $35, but you know, it's a hardbound book, 250 pages with illustrations and photographs. This hardbound book is also part of a trilogy that Mr. Swiss wrote. There are two other titles. There's Shattering Illusions and Devious Standards. Plus, you can also get the deluxe set. So you, like I said, it's a trilogy, right? So you can get the deluxe set for $175. This is a signed and numbered set. Every single uh, set is signed and numbered. Uh, they're also on leatherette covers, leatherette covers, and you're gonna get an extra book included. That's right, so if you buy the deluxe set, you'll get four books instead of three. Light and Heat is only available in the deluxe set. All right, so what do I think? Uh, what do I think? He's a very good writer. I mean, you, you kinda, kinda have to be if you've written for Genie and you, know, you write for blogs. I mean, this is what he's known for. Uh, he's a very good writer. It's great prose to sit and read. It's great to sit and ponder. I like reading this before I go to bed. Uh, it's just, you know, good thoughts to go to sleep to. Probably a good, like, meditation book or a good, like, devotional book on magic, I think. This is only gonna make you a, a better performer, okay? This is only gonna make you a better performer. It's probably reserved only for people who wanna go pro, though, I think. This is for professionals who are working in the industry already or people who want to go pro. So I don't know that the amateur or the hobbyist magician, this is, this is gonna be for them, but definitely a beautifully written book. All right, so that is my review of Preserving a Mystery from Vanishing Incorporated and Jamie Ian Swiss. I wanna thank Murphy's Magic for allowing me to have this so that I could do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase this book for yourself, you can find it from your very favorite Murphy's Magic retailer. Thanks, bye.